Hi, I'm Mike Thompson. Occasionally in SolidWorks, you'll get this pesky mod diam thing. We're going to show you how to get rid of that. If we zoom in here to this sketch, you'll see what I mean. The diameter symbol is missing, and we've got this pesky mod diam here that's on this quarter inch hole. So if you go to my website download page, download the gtall.sim file that I've uploaded for you. And so what we're going to do is we're going to put it in a place we can remember. I'm going to put it in this SolidWorks data folder and put it right there. Now, we're going to go into SolidWorks and go up here to Options, and then we're going to drop down this menu. I'll drag it over here so I can, you can actually see it because it was on another screen. On this left-hand pane over here, we're going to go down to File Locations. Now here, the default is the uh, template. We don't want this. We need to go up here and drop this down to Symbol Library File near the bottom. Right there. Okay, so we're going to click on that. And it's looking here for this. Whatever's here, we're going to delete that. And now we're going to add a new one, which is the one we just saved on our computer, the gtall.sim file that you guys just downloaded off my website. It's the file I've been using for the last four years every time I upgrade, so it still works. We're going to find it here, and when we get to that folder, SolidWorks Data folder, select it. There it is. And we're going to hit OK, and watch this. Boom. Now you can see it instantly updated on the spot now that it knows where to look. And that's all there is to it. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. I'm Mike Thompson, and thanks for watching. I really appreciate it.